Welcome back. I've got Keith McDougall Jr. here at JU. Keith, uh, last year, uh, disappointing season uh, record-wise, but for you, kind of a, a, a double double blow because you had that injury that, that really had you miss half the season. Talk about it a little bit. Oh uh, well, yeah. Uh, it, it was kind of it was kind of let down, you know, uh, my injury. But uh, sitting sitting on the bench with the, and watching the team and what we needed to work on and what what was working, what wasn't working, it's going to help out this year. We were visiting a moment ago with Coach Warren and, and, and talking about this year's roster and the flexibility it looks like it will afford Coach and things he wants to do in-game, um, adjustments, things like that, different styles of play. You're kind of one of those players that fits right in that mold, kind of a 2-3 guy that gives Coach a lot of flexibility. Right. Uh, I mean, with the whole team, everybody everybody you know contributes uh, significantly to the team. So, I mean, not just one person. Exactly. Looks like this year, obviously watching some workouts, uh, yourself and several other players really seem to to be able to shoot the ball. I mean, at times we struggled shooting the ball in long range last year. Uh, I mean, I'm thinking we're going to have a better shooting team in, in your opinion this year. Right. Hopefully, we'll be able to open up the defense a little bit more. We'll be able to uh, get get up and running. And speaking of opening up the defense, in the middle we'll visit with Glenn Powell, but. Um, Basketball 101, opening up a defense inside out. If you can establish a presence inside, the defense has to really respect that, and that kick out three is there. It would appear, we'll get Glenn to talk about this as well, but it would appear we'll, we'll have a lot more presence down low that will help that inside out game. Right, yeah, we we'll like Dario Fleming, Javon Dawson, and of course Glenn Powell, Tyler Alderman, yeah, they're all pretty good and solid down low. You kind of, uh, you're a Jacksonville guy, and uh, you, you've been around here a while now, you, you're not the freshman. More sophomore anymore, you kind of one of the team leaders. You've got kind of a twinkle in your eye. You're kind of excited about the season. Right, exactly. You know, I have uh, a lot of good good things. Hopefully this coming up here, uh, going to the NCAA tournament, conference tournament, and coming home with a ring. Uh, Keith, thanks for your time. We'll get your big man going. Now up next.